Hey, good evening, everyone. Pastor Brett here. Just wanted to show you this Bible um, that I received in the mail uh, as a gift from a brother um, in the Lord. And uh, um, I hesitated to show it at first uh, just because uh, I didn't want any confusion over the version issue. Um, so... Uh, I didn't, uh, um, I don't want to be a source of confusion because I'm not confused. Um, I know which version I love and trust and use um, as uh, um, my foundation, and that's the King James Version. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm really um, having fun with that right there. Um, that's just a vinyl... Um, Perfect bound, but it's Rock of Ages study Bible. Ah, I'll have to show you that in another video. Um, <clears throat> this is the Albert Moeller Grace and Truth Study Bible by Zondervan. Uh, this is a premier um, goatskin leather um, cover. It is perimeter stitched, as you can see. Beautifully done. Um, what an amazing Bible. I haven't even formed the yap yet. It has a generous yap, not full. Um, and, of course, it has the raised hubs on the spine. NASB Grace and Truth Study Bible. Uh, this brother saw, um, he saw a video, a walk through Ollie's, in which I saw the Grace and Truth Study Bible, but I only saw it in the NAV, and I, I had said that I, I wished I could get it in the uh, another version uh, other than that, and I, I wasn't specific, um, just said another version. Well, he found this, and just, he said the Lord moved him to get it for me, asked me to keep it in my library, and so that's what I am doing. It stays in my library, and, and I do use it. I use it every time I listen to Pastor John MacArthur. Um, I listen to him. I read from this. Um, look, um, you can't tell me that he's not saved. You can't tell me that he hasn't been used of God moitily in this time and day and age uh, that we live. Um, Pastor John MacArthur um, has been a tremendous example to the church at large, and I'm thankful for him. But Albert Moeller has been quite an example himself. Yeah, see, I get to looking at the Bible, and I don't watch on the camera. I got to keep my eye on the camera, because then you end up out here while I'm talking about the Bible. Uh, hallelujah. Forgive me. Um, wait till you see this inside liner. Boom. Oh, doesn't that pop? Isn't that beautiful? If the glare bothers you, forgive me. Um, yeah, it's edge-lined, beautifully done, as you can see. Um, goatskin leather cover, and the leather liner, of course. It's a goatskin liner. Um, nice final end sheet. There's your presentation page. Absolutely beautiful presentation page. Grace and Truth. Grace and Truth Study Bible by Zondervan. Now, this is an amazing Bible. I'm, I'm not a big fan of this border here. Not a big fan of that border. Too busy for me. And then it's all throughout the text. And so you can almost see it when you look at the pages. You can see it. And so, uh, I guess it was designed to do that. Um, I don't know. Here's your copyright info. You can pause it and look at it anytime. That is the Grace and Truth Study Bible, uh, 20, 2022 by Zondervan. And, uh, yep, yeah, New American Standard. NASB. It's not the NASV, right? It's not the New American Standard Version. 
It's the New American Standard Bible. Yeah, that's what the King James people like to say, right? It's not the KJV. It's the KJB. Um, oh, yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Um, New American Standard. Um, I've used this for 34 years in counseling. Um, never knew nothing about early on when I first started reading the NAS. I never knew nothing about the version issue or anything like that. All right, here is the first book um, of the Bible, Genesis. And this is just your introduction to the text. It's just a page and a half, but just concise what you need. Um, yeah, Albert Muller doesn't, you know, um, talk just to hear himself talking. You know, he gets, you know, to the point and that's it. Uh, the text block is beautiful. It is a um, nine point font. Um, but it's a beautifully readable 2K Denmark, of course, uh, footnotes in the corner, center column references, and then your notes by none other than Albert Moeller. I love Albert Moeller, man. Don't envy his position, uh, at the SBC either. Not at all. Three um, ribbon markers, Beresfords, the red, honey, gold, and brown. Um, this is more like a brass, a bronze. It says honey gold, though. But, uh, yeah, you get your gold gilt line. Perimeter gilt line. Uh, the corner work is up excellent on this Bible. Oh, I just, I got to wrap it with some wrap. I'm going to get some saran wrap, plastic wrap, and I'm going to wrap it and shape the app. And then I'll show you this Bible at another time. Um, but you look at this Bible now, and this Bible is absolutely amazing. Um, it has uh, not red letter, it's black letter. Traditional NAS, black letter, I love it. NAS has got the best text. So, And then, of course, uh, it has maps. The, the, this Bible, it, it's got a big concordance, uh, a very highly readable concordance, not like uh, Schuyler's concordances, uh, very, very hard to read in the Schuyler Bibles. But this, oh, this is amazing. And it's got maps, of course, beautiful maps. Thomas Nelson, Zondervan, Thomas Nelson, maps, traditional. Not too much. Just what you need, um, and, and plenty of them. I think there's, what, 15 maps in this uh, Bible? Yeah. My note regarding the type tells you it's 2K Denmark. You have a section for notes in the back here. Not a lot of note paper, but a few sheets indexed to the maps. And then, of course, you know, like I said, your concordance. Quite a um, healthy concordance. It's not exhaustive, but boy, it's extensive. Um, good stuff. Yep. So. I'm thankful. What a blessing this is. Uh, it measures six by nine on the text block. Um, six by eight, excuse me, on the text block. And so um, it's uh, an inch and three quarters thick. Um, it's not a heavy Bible. I would weigh it in at about three pounds. It's, it, it well, that, that you can consider that heavy, I guess, but. I don't. Um, what a wonderful Bible. I couldn't ask for a, a more thoughtful gift. Um, and uh, it's a Bible that I will cherish and I will use 
Um, thank you, brother. I use it um, in my comparative studies and, uh, of course, with Albert Moeller's notes. Uh, I love Albert Moeller, man. So thank the Lord for uh, um, his grace and mercy. Thanks for looking at this Bible with me. This is the NASB Grace and Truth Study Bible, um, printed by Zondervan. And, uh, and uh, yep, it is a beautiful goat skin leather cover hallelujah with the red liner amazing um what a great study bible thanks for watching everybody um jesus loves you we love you i hope and pray that you have a great rest of your evening in jesus name